dollars for my car, for my bike, for everything. Just a few more dollars, dollars. First time in the light, guys. Here it is. 72 model. European. I like it. How hard could it be? Okay. This is a 72 Beetle and it's got new claws in it, but they haven't been welded in. See? My job is to weld them in. Piece of cake. Right, uh, here you go guys, this is a 72 Beetle and uh, it needs some repairs after even the body's been painted and here we go, so they're brand new heater channels, the whole lot is brand new, um, see I've finished all in there, I welded it all, uh, patch panels up in here, right through, now I'm on to the other side, doing it properly. guys uh, I'm up to this cut out here I've been putting a new clutch cable in and through here you're going to put a new fuel line they say don't do it I know why they say don't do it because they're lazy so I've cut a window out here in here's a tab and come around here quickly and this is where the fuel line goes I've got a brand new one and it's in here yep. uh, I'm just going Guys, um, here's the new fuel line. It's absolutely uh, copper nickel and it's six mil. Right, you, I slid it in from the back end in through, so you just got to put it out of the way of the gear linkage, that's the only thing. Put it underneath, you travel it through, you can see it through in there, and in there's a hatch. And then I cut a little thing here to cut the tab off the old one. I took the old one out, everyone leaves them in. And here, it comes through here, you crimp the tab over, goes in this hole and ends up out here. All up. Yeah, that one there, right there. It's come out. So all up, one hour. One hour, and I didn't know what I was doing. That's one hour. So when I get good, 20 minutes. Hi folks. Uh, I'm in this corner here, probably on this first half. This is a new pan, they remake these, 225 pounds. This is the jacking thing I've got to weld on. I'm not sure if I weld it on now because when I turn it over, if I hit it. So this is all welded in, it's all fixed now, and welds are cleaned up, now painted a bit, and uh, sky's the limit. It's all on this side too. It's all dressed up, and what I do is I prime it, and then I put sealer on it. So it seals it from the outside to the inside. Yeah, I'm doing the bulkhead here. Bulkhead, uh, a little bit hard to see, but I've cleaned it all up, straightened the weld out, got the rust off, and uh, they cut a hole in here. I'll, I'll have to fill that. And these holes here I have to fill. I'm welding the floor pan back on. Brand new one. Uh, hi guys, it's about, what, the 27th of May, 28th, uh, around uh, Friday anyway, uh, 2022. Um, here's the new clutch cable in, 
that goes into there. Uh, new fuel line to the copper nickel in there. That uh, goes all the way through. Uh, I've done the right hand pan and sealed it up. Right. That's all sealed. I've flipped. I've flipped the chassis over from the other side to this side so I can weld the left hand side. The driver's side's done. And now I've got this. Prep four holes here. And then after that, in the afternoon, I'll be sealing it up after it's fully welded. Progress, great. Most of the new car, he's handing it over. Right? I want for the good, good choice. Here we go, an update on the right hand uh, guard underneath, so there's no rust. There's just a few lumps because it had a new front welded on and they've blended it. Right, so I've just got to get a, a couple of lumps out. I might, a little bit of filler, other than that it's all sanded, it's buffed and there's no rust. Right guys, right under the guard here, I've sanded it, primed it and now I've Etch prime. That's only etch primer. Only etch primer. But um, next will be two pack grey. Uh, hi guys uh, and root. So uh, this is the right hand side under the guard. Still a bit wet. Uh, this is um, so. What I did is I etched, etch primed it, and then two pack, two pack primer with colour. And I've gone for light grey of Deutsch in German. It's called Hellgrau. Hell, so light grey, and that's finished. That's two pack. It's hardening up now. Looks perfect. Yeah, it's about the 8th of June, and um, I've decided to rub all this down. I've uh, filled all the holes and everything like that. Uh, there's no rust under here. It's all been taken out. In the UK, it's quite. Things are quite rusty and I painted, I edge primed it this morning and then this afternoon I uh, painted it two pack acrylic uh, light grey and that's my top coat. An, an auction here and it's got four minutes to go. I just got one job lot, right, four minutes and I'm going to do a semi trick. And I'm going to put my bid on, maximum of 32 pounds. It's at 12 and a half pounds. The guy nearly picked me by two pounds last time. And we're going again, but I'm going to put an extra two pounds on it. So we'll see how we go. Are you nervous? Oh, jeez. I'm not sure if I won the bid. It's still, it's still clarifying it. Still clarifying it. 21. Yeah, I won it. Yeah, Bill G, I've got it. No nerves here, mate. Two bits, two bits coming to CD Coxa. No, it's called, I don't know what it's called. Yes, it's called Vicarage. Thank you very much. Hi guys. Bonnie the Beetle. Get my makeover. See in here. I zinc primed it. And then I rubbed it back. And then I etch primed it. And I sprayed on two pack grey. So that's underneath, it's ready to go. I'm working on this inside guard, and then that's underneath, at the front, all finished. All right, uh, here we go, uh, Bonnie the Beetle. Now, uh, working hard, I'm sanding all this back, and um, uh, where the brake reservoir is, there was a little bit of rust around there, so I got rid of that. I'm gonna do all blends, Blending it all because I'm going to paint this nicely in two pack, and uh, so I've been rubbing all day as well as here. I've prepped all in under there, she's ready for a coat of paint. Mint. Right, so what we got here is a couple of boxes, these were separate eBay auctions. Uh, I'm not sure the prices, I think one was 31 and one was about 20. And then we had uh, postage, and these are Volkswagen parts. And I can use the, I'm, I'm looking for parts for the car, 
so they come in handy. Like I don't have a rear spring for the deck leaf, there it is. And these heat diffusers, there it is. Alright, we'll just leave that simple there. Okay, uh, here we go. So left hand under left hand side under the guard, uh, etch primed uh, in these facilities here. It's <laughs> a bit compact, but it's okay. I'm happy. And uh, then light grey two pack primer, two coats this time, two coats. I might leave it like this. business meeting and um, this is how we deck the table and we've got our laptop here and we're going to crunch numbers to see if Bonnie's on track and everything else is on track. <laughs> 